Hello, my name is Maria Milagros Vasquez, and I'm coming to you today because I am the new outreach counselor for a program, a brand new pilot program that was um, that is a partnership between Mount Wachusett Community College and the Shannon Grant. And the program doesn't have a name, so I've decided to name it the Senior Success Program because that just feels nice. And um, so that could change. It's just a working title. But I wanted to share a little bit about the program so that other people who um, are interested or who wanted to know more about it could know what it is before they start recommending or referring seniors. So essentially, a senior, a high school senior will apply for the program and they have to fill out an application and then we do a quick phone interview just so that they're aware of what they're getting themselves into because I will be holding them accountable. And um, the parents also have to be involved and agree to the kid being part, a participant in the program. Once that happens, then through the program, I'll be providing the students with coaching, training, support, accountability, and connection to different resources because the goal is to make sure that these students are getting what they need now through the summer and into their first semester at the Mount in order to ensure that they're reaching their full potential and they're getting the most out of their their time, right? That they're able to tap into what it is that they have so they can truly achieve the dreams that they have for themselves one step at a time. So my goal, my desire is to help them get there and to be that kind of pillar person who will be the one that they can check in with and connect with along the way in terms of coaching and accountability and trainings and workshops and things like that. Um, so essentially the students um, need to be from either Fitchburg, Lemonster, or Gardner High. They need to be, um, I need to have a diverse cohort of students. They need to be from a low-income family, first-generation college students. Um, either themselves or their parents can have been court involved, a single parent household, any other factors that you could think of that might make that student an underserved student might be one of the factors that are listed in the grant. Now, the thing with grants is that they're very specific in how they're written. And so we have to meet the criteria of the grant in order to receive the funding to do the work and to do the things that we want to do with these students. That doesn't mean that other students aren't deserving of these same supports. It just means that this is specifically what this grant is written for. Now, the good thing is that this is a pilot program. So if it is successful, hopefully this would be the kind of thing that we can start implementing in other places and in other areas eventually. But we do have to take it one step at a time. And the first step is that I need your help in recruiting some seniors. Because I had three days of training before the schools closed down due to COVID-19. And I didn't have an opportunity to go into the schools and actually meet the seniors themselves to talk about the program, to answer their questions. So I am literally cold calling seniors, which of course there's a number that they don't recognize or rather the parents don't recognize. So they're not answering. I'm leaving voicemails. But again, if they're anything like me, I don't check my voicemails right away. I don't even get an indication on my phone that I have voicemails. So it could be a week, if not more, before I receive a voicemail. So, I mean, before I can check it. So I'm emailing, I'm cold calling, I'm leaving voicemails. There are some parents that I've had the opportunity to talk to and get the applications to, which is awesome. But I need your help in making sure that we're getting these seniors who can benefit from this program to this program. So we can, I need you to help me be that bridge because again, I haven't had the opportunity to meet them myself by going into the schools and doing this. So if you know anyone who could benefit from the program, please have them connect with me or you can share this video and just have them watch the video. And if they're interested, connect with me. Um, so again, my name is Maria Milagros Vasquez. My email is M V A Z Q U E Z, the number nine, at mwcc.mass.edu. So that's mvasquez9 at mwcc.mass.edu. They can also call me to my work line, which is 617-714-9763. 
if I get a call from a number that I don't know from that line, I usually answer it until about 3 30, 4 o'clock. That's when my work day ends. And if I'm not available because I'm in a training or I'm doing a seminar or I'm on another call, please leave me a message or send me a text and just say, I'm interested in the program. Please send us the application. Here's my email address or something like that. I'm, I'm more than willing to answer any of your questions and to help anybody fill out the application if that's also a hurdle that you need to get over. So again, please reach out if you know of a high school senior from either Fitchburg, Lemister, or Gardner High who would be interested in participating in this senior success program so we can get started immediately, if not sooner. Okay, thank you so much.